Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're diving into a hot topic for aspiring data scientists, personal projects that will impress recruiters. Whether you're just starting or looking to level up your career, this video will give you the insights you need to stand out. Let's get started. First off, let's talk about why personal projects are so important. They not only showcase your skills, but also your passion and initiative. Recruiters love to see that you're proactive and can take a project from concept to completion. But what kind of projects catch their eye? Here are some top recommendations. One, real world data projects. Recruiters are looking for projects that solve real problems. Think about issues in your community or industry and use publicly available data sets to address them. You can find these data sets on websites such as Google Cloud Public Datasets, Kaggle, Stratascratch, UCI Machine Learning Repository, data.gov, and World Bank Open Data. Real world projects show that you can apply your skills in practical, impactful ways. Project suggestions. One, traffic pattern analysis. Use public data sets to analyze traffic patterns. Develop a project that proposes optimized routes or identifies congestion hotspots. This can help in urban planning and reducing traffic jams. For example, you could use the traffic prediction data set on Kaggle or NHTSA traffic fatalities data set on Google Cloud public data sets. Two, housing market trends, access historical housing data to predict future trends. This could involve price predictions, identifying up and coming neighborhoods, or analyzing the impact of economic factors on housing markets. For this project, you could use the Zillow Home Value Index dataset on Kaggle or the Real Estate Sales 2001 to 2021 GL dataset on data.gov. Three, healthcare data analysis. Utilize public health datasets to predict disease outbreaks, hospital admissions, or patient outcomes. Some suggested datasets are health nutrition and population statistics on World Bank Open Data, the death rates for suicide by sex, race, Hispanic origin, and age, United States dataset on data.gov, and various health datasets on Kaggle. Four, environmental impact studies. Use data on air quality, water quality, or deforestation rates to analyze environmental impacts. Projects could focus on predicting pollution levels or assessing the effectiveness of environmental policies. For example, you could use the air quality dataset on data.gov or the GBIF species occurrences dataset on Google Cloud public datasets. Two, open source contributions. Contributing to open source projects is a great way to demonstrate your coding skills and ability to collaborate with others. Platforms like GitHub are perfect for this. You can start by fixing bugs, adding features, or improving documentation for popular data science tools and libraries. Where do you find projects you can contribute to? Here are some suggestions. One, finding projects. GitHub offers personalized recommendations for projects based on your past contributions and stars. This can help you find projects that match your interests and skills. Two, first contributions. The first contributions project on GitHub is designed to help beginners make their first contribution. It provides a step-by-step -step guide to navigating the process, making it easier to get started. Three, beginner-friendly projects. The Awesome for Beginners repository on GitHub lists projects that are friendly to beginners. These projects are curated to help newcomers find opportunities to contribute meaningfully without being overwhelmed. Four, guides and resources. The Free Code Camp page on GitHub offers a comprehensive guide to contributing to open source, including a list of resources for beginners. This guide can help you understand the process and find suitable projects. Five, comprehensive guide. A step-by-step -step guide titled, A Comprehensive Guide to Contributing to Open Source Projects, available on Medium provides detailed instructions on how to choose projects, set up your environment, and start contributing to open source. This can be particularly useful if you prefer a more structured approach. Six, specific projects. If you want specific projects, why not contribute to tools often used in data science, such as Pandas, Scikit-learn, TensorFlow, Apache Spark, Project Jupyter, and Data Version Control DVC. Three, research projects. If you're inclined towards academia, working on a research project can be very impressive. This could involve developing new algorithms, improving existing ones, or exploring novel applications of data science. Publishing your findings in journals or presenting at conferences can significantly boost your profile. Project suggestions. One, developing new algorithms. Create an innovative algorithm to solve a specific problem more efficiently. For example, 
you could work on a new clustering algorithm that handles large datasets better than existing methods. Google Cloud Public Datasets offers a vast collection of large-scale datasets that can be used to test and develop new algorithms. Two, improving existing algorithms. Take an existing algorithm and enhance its performance or accuracy. This could involve optimizing a neural network for faster training times or improving the accuracy of a recommendation system. UCI Machine Learning Repository provides a wide variety of datasets commonly used to benchmark and improve algorithms. Three, novel applications of data science. Apply data science techniques to new fields or problems. For example, you could explore the use of machine learning in climate modeling or personalized healthcare. Kaggle datasets, which include include various datasets for different fields, including climate data and healthcare statistics, might be a good source for exploring new applications of data science. Four, personal interests. Tie your projects to your hobbies or interests. If you love sports, analyze player performance data. Into music, try creating a recommendation system for your favorite genre. Projects that reflect your personality make you memorable and show that you can bring your unique perspective to the table. Project suggestions. One, sports analytics. If you love sports, consider analyzing player performance data, create a project that predicts player statistics, evaluates team strategies, or analyzes game outcomes. For example, you could use machine learning to predict the performance of basketball players based on historical data. Use datasets from Kaggle's sports data repositories, which include various sports statistics and performance data. Two, music recommendation system. For music enthusiasts, Building a recommendation system can be an exciting project. Use data from music streaming services to develop an algorithm that suggests songs or artists based on user preferences and listening history. Use the Spotify dataset available on Kaggle, which provides extensive data on songs, artists, and user interactions. Three, movie rating predictor. If you're a movie buff, you can create a model that predicts movie ratings based on various factors like genre, director, and cast. You can use datasets from sites like IMDb or MovieLens to train your model. You can find the MovieLens dataset on GroupLens or Kaggle, which is widely used for movie rating prediction and contains comprehensive data on movies, ratings, and user preferences. Four, travel data analysis. For those who love traveling, analyze travel-related data. Projects could include predicting the best times to visit certain destinations, analyzing tourist satisfaction, or optimizing travel itineraries. Use datasets from travel platforms like TripAdvisor or Expedia, which provide reviews, ratings, and booking information. These can be found through various open data portals and repositories, such as Kaggle or GitHub. All right, now that we've covered the types of projects, let's talk about presentation. How you showcase your work is just as important as the work itself. Here are some tips. One, portfolio website. Create a clean, professional website to host your projects. Include detailed write-ups, code snippets, and visualizations. This makes it easy for recruiters to see your work and understand your process. Two, GitHub repositories. Make sure your GitHub repos are well-organized and documented. Include readme files that explain the project, installation instructions, and how to use your code. This demonstrates your attention to detail and professionalism. Three, blogs and articles. Writing about your projects on platforms like Medium or LinkedIn can help you reach a broader audience. Share insights, challenges, and what you learned. This not only shows your communication skills, but also your willingness to help others in the community. So there you have it. Personal projects are a fantastic way to showcase your skills and passion to recruiters. Remember to focus on real world applications, contribute to open source, engage in research, and tie your work to your personal interests. And don't forget to present your projects professionally. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more content like this. Also, let us know in the comments what projects you're working on or planning to start. We'd love to hear from you.